Hello, my name's Charlie. I'm a senior technician here at Diamond Multimedia, and I'm here to introduce the latest members of our VStream family. We're going to go ahead and start off with our VS50 unit. Now, with the VS50, you're going to receive an HDMI sender and receiver. Now, with these units, you can transmit audio and video wirelessly up to 30 feet. Now, each one of these, cap each one of these units is going to come with a cable. These are going to be the micro USB cables, the same kind you would see with an Android phone. Now, I'm going to go ahead and show you how simple it is to set these units up by plugging it into this laptop. Now I'm going to go ahead and plug in the HDMI and the USB for power. Now we're going to get the receiver here, plug in the power cable, and since the TV is set to HDMI 4, I'm going to plug this into HDMI 4. And we're not going to need this anymore. I mean, the range for this unit is 30 feet. So there is no longer going to be a need for any HDMI cable. Okay, now that, we've had, now that we've had both these units connected, let me go ahead and introduce our VS100. Now, this unit is like the VS50, the only thing is the range on this unit is 150 feet. And then behind it, we have our VS300M. Now, the range for this unit is also 150 feet, but the main difference is you can have multiple TVs, multiple projectors, multiple devices connected to one source, to one sender. Now here we have video. I'll go ahead and press play here. And we're going to be receiving, there it is, audio and video being transmitted wirelessly from the laptop to the TV. And if you keep an eye on the images, there is almost no delay here. But let's say you don't want to go ahead and connect it to a computer. You want to go ahead and connect it to your set-top box, to your, to your satellite box, and the TV is far away, and you don't want to go ahead and get a long cable. Well, the beauty of this unit is you need no software whatsoever. Right here I'm going to demonstrate with our digital to analog converter that you can go ahead and plug it in. All you need is an HDMI connection and a USB connection. The great thing about the USB is you can use a power bank, you can use a cell phone charger. Anything that could power a USB will power this unit. Now I'm going to go ahead and use our HDMI extender and you do get a pair of these with a kit. So let's go ahead and plug this in. And then we're going to go ahead and give it a few seconds for our digital to analog converter box. This box gets a signal from over the air, trans transmits it to digital, and it's going to go straight to the TV. No extra, no long HDMI cable needed. No software needed whatsoever. All you need, like I said, is an is a HDMI connection. And there you go. Audio and video. But then again, let's say you're a gamer like me. You have your Xbox One, your PS4, or in our case, we have a Nintendo Switch here. We're going to go ahead and plug the VS50 into the Nintendo Switch. Now we're going to go ahead and plug in the power. And once again, we're going to use the HDMI extender and plug that in here. I'm going to close this up. And there we go. We're getting our image from the Nintendo Switch to the TV without an HDMI cable. Now you might be asking, where, where can you go ahead and purchase one of these VStreams? Well, the great thing is you can order them online from retailers like Amazon, or you can go to our website directly to order from us, diamondmm.com. And should you have any questions, you can go ahead and contact us there as well. We'll be more than happy to help you. So once again, this is the VS50. It has a range of 30 feet. The VS100 has a range of 150 feet. Our VS300M also has a range of 150 feet, but it allows you to connect two monitors, two, two display sources to one sender. And that website again is diamondmm.com. Thank you.